Turning to Community Matters this morning, the annual Kids Day event is taking place this weekend. Lucky for you, it's going to be a great day. We here at Local 22 and Local 44 are very proud sponsors of this year's event. Yay! Emma Allen is with us and she helped put this event together. She's here to tell us a little bit about what we can expect. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you for being here. Thank you for having me. So I hear there's bees. Yes, so mm. 34th Kids Day. Uh, it's hard to believe it's been happening wow. that long in Burlington. Um, We'll be at Waterfront Park this okay. Saturday, 10 to 3, and this year's theme is celebrating pollinators. Hmm, okay. um, so there's a few different ways that we're going to be bringing that into the event. Okay. Um, right at 10, we'll have a press conference with a bunch of city partners mm -hmm. to, um, to announce and celebrate the city recently becoming, uh, getting a Bee City USA designation. Very cool. Which is a pretty big deal. That is a big deal. Um, and then we'll also be uh, showcasing our new mascot, doing a doing a new reveal. We just Ooh. got a new mascot that we're really excited about. Nice. Um, and and that will kind of tie in. Yeah. If you can, if you can guess. Um. Mm. I wonder. <laughs> <laughs> Love uh, it. Yeah. So what else can people expect when they come to this for a first time or say? Yes. Uh, it's big and crazy, but it's a lot of fun. Really we have so many different things. Uh, we usually partner with Vermont Rail and they do train okay. rides. Ooh. Um, yeah, 45 minute train rides out and back mm -hmm. um, from Burlington and that's always a big hit. Um, sure. The event kicks off with a parade at 930 down okay. College Street. Mm -hmm. um, so we kick off at 930, we roll down into Waterfront Park. Um, other than the train rides, we have Big Blue Trunk, we have a petting zoo, face painting, uh, balloon hats, wow. a ton of different um, activities in our large kids activity tent um, and there's like dozens and dozens of vendors there that are showcasing lots of really cool things. That's fantastic. Yeah. Now how many people are you expecting to come out this year? Uh, it, usually tw uh, 2,000, 2,500. I think That's it's a big. little weather dependent but we yeah. really we it's pack gonna the be a nice part. day. It's yes. gonna be a nice day. Yes. That's wonderful. Yeah. Now what is an event like this in your opinion would you say do for the community? Why is it so special? My favorite part about Kids Day is that everything is free, um, and I feel like having an inclusive event like that in Burlington is really important. Mm -hmm. um, so parents that are looking for a fun all-day um, opportunity to do with their kids where they're not stressing about having to spend any money to do things, um, we, have, we have everything that you could want for a fun afternoon in the park. You know, you can get outside, you can exercise, you can do some crafts, get your face painted, um, and then something that we always do that we really like is we work with the Burlington School Food Project okay. to give free meals um, for all the kids that are there. That's fantastic. So there will be lunch for people to purchase, but then also um, kids that are looking for a free meal, we do provide that. And that's something we've been doing for a few years, right. and we're really, um, I think last year we fed like 800 kids. That is incredible. Yeah. Amazing work. I love yeah. that. That's fantastic. Yeah. Now, what is something that's going to be different this year than other years? Um, so our theme changes every year. Okay. So the pollinators. Um, and in addition to that presence, um, right at the beginning of the event, we will have a couple different folks tabling and doing specific pollinator crafts, mm -hmm. like uh, making seed bombs mm -hmm. and talking about bees, butterflies, birds, plants, yeah. everything um, that keeps Burlington's ecosystem healthy. Yeah. Um, this year the site will be a little different because of construction down at Waterfront Park that's just finishing right, up. Right, right, right. So we'll be a little bit south of where we usually are, but still same general location, mm -hmm. very easy to find right at the bottom of College Street. Wonderful. Um, and tell us the times again so that people know. Yes, 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. down okay. at Waterfront Park mm -hmm. and the parade on College Street starts at 9.30. Fantastic. Yeah. Very exciting. We wish you the best. Thank, Thank you for being here. Yes. We appreciate it. Wishing you all the best. Thank and of course, we'll be there too. We're the sponsors. Hey. All right. All that information too will be on our website, myshamplainvalley.com. We'll be back.